Hey, welcome to another Windows 8 video on the official Windows 8 channel. Uh, today we'll show you another way to actually go into the advanced options in Windows 8, uh, the advanced boot options. So um, if you've looked at the other videos, uh, a very easy way was to uh, simply go into your charms bar and when you're on your power settings, you just hold down one of the shift keys. Um, when you ask someone to do such a maneuver, hold down a key and press another option at the same time, uh, there's always people that have difficulty in doing it right. So there's, of course, another option into uh, how to go to the uh, advanced boot options. So what you do is you go into your charms bar on the right side, so by swiping or going to the corners with your mouse pointer, go into settings and go into change PC settings. On the left side, you'll go into the general tab, and on the right side, you'll go up to the bottom. It says advanced startup. So if you want to have your advanced startup, all you have to do is go restart now on the advanced startup. And this is going to bring you into the advanced boot options automatically. So that's another way of going to your advanced boot options. And if you need to go, for example, uh, boot a device, well you'll have the possibility to boot from a bootable USB key or a bootable CD or DVD and um, you can of course go into your troubleshoot there you'll have your refresh your PC and uh, reset your PC so um, if you need to reinstall and advanced options of course if you need for example to go into um, other modes and system restore command prompt system recovery so all of there, all that information is there if you need. And um, if your computer doesn't boot up well, that's another way of going to uh, different options, including the uh, safe mode. Just by going to startup settings and doing a restart, you'll have the uh, safe mode available. So that's the way to go if you need to uh, just go into those options. Uh, this is a great and easy way also to go into those boot options. And if you've uh, done or you uh, made it by mistake, well, you just exit and go back to Windows 8 and everything's going to go back to normal. So this was another way of going into your advanced boot options. It's always uh, very interesting to have the advanced boot options because one of the reasons why you want to have advanced boot options is that maybe your computer is having a problem and you want to have a uh, possibility to access some information that is not always available or programs that are stuck and you know you know that by going to safe mode you can uh, fix it. A lot of uh, um, computer tech repairs or uh, of, of problematic software or even of viruses uh, usually a lot of those um, work in um, safe mode because you have access to files and some folders and sometimes even possibility of uh, um, possibility of um, simply uh, erasing some problematic files just by just by going into safe mode because the um, Windows Windows itself will not have any of the um, uh, its hold on some of the, 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 the folders and the um, files because in regular mode, a lot of the files are really locked down. You can't really do much. So safe mode is good for that, for example. So if you enjoy videos, click the subscribe button and you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, maybe a request of a video or feature you'd like us to do, let us know. We'll try to put a video online for you. And uh, if you have any, uh, if you have that new computer, well, hey, you know, look, take a look at our other videos we have online. Lots and lots of stuff online. To help you use your Windows 8 machine. So thanks for watching. Hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Bye bye.